Hello and welcome, it's Tyson here. I'm getting ready to put some footage together the other day. Of, uh, Scott Wiles called me, emailed me. He had some foot, uh, some stuff he found up at uh, a place called Fogarty Creek State Recreation Area out of Newport, Oregon. And uh, also on a beach called uh, Beverly Beach. So I went up there and we went, went to both those places and took some footage. It's some quite impressive stuff. So I'm going to get going. It's probably going to be uh, two videos on Fogarty and probably be two videos coming off of Beverly. Um, also, I want to show you this real quick though. So if you take a look on Google Earth at this fluting right here along the Oregon coast, this is kind of a dead giveaway that the stuff that I find inland of a creature um, is what I find a lot of. So um, <laughs> this is part of the creature that's actually laying along the coast right here. So uh, the bone, the stuff I'm finding lately. So anyway, um, I'm gonna get started here. So we were out of uh, uh, New, New, Newport, Oregon, which is a uh, a really nice town, a, a place where people come and do a lot of recreational stuff in the summer. So we were just north of there um, at this Fogarty Creek recreation area. And um, we parked over here on this side of the highway and walked underneath the Highway 101 and came over here and along this beach checking out this stuff here which is biological you're gonna see three discs three round discs that are right here along the water right now uh, we, we, we we point these out and I don't believe these are connected to this I believe they're totally something different uh, we're not quite sure what they are but they're definitely biological and they're buried under the sand there uh, I come over here and show you stuff along this beachhead too that's uh, pretty impressive I'm gonna turn this around here and I also we come up into here and look along this uh, this this head wall, this uh, sea wall along here with some really spectacular stuff along right on here right now. Right now the tide's up and you can't see it. Uh, the day we're here is on a minus tide, and we show you a bunch of stuff along here. So anyway, that's where we were. And on, uh, when I do the videos on Beverly Beach, I will do a separate thing. So uh, there'll probably be two videos come off of Fogarty Creek. So hang with me here as I get started on these, and thank you for joining me. Okay, uh, I'm up here at Fogarty Beach with Scott Wells. The Wiles, we, uh, he's got some stuff up here we're looking at. I'm trying to piece it together. We'll look at it here. But he's, he called me the other day because these discs, they're laying on the beach right over there. One there, one there, and one over there. And you got all that stuff in lines over there. And then the stuff I'm standing on, we'll get some pictures of it. And we got a lot of good stuff going on here. Intersitching, we got skin, we got uh, this thing running and runs right up into this. It's all biological, and that's what I'm trying to show you with these videos. Was to, how to look at things biologically, not look at them like we do that we've been taught of geological uplift and tectonic plates. That's not true. Things move around, yes, but they're creatures. Um, these are all creatures proving the ancient texts were correct. So uh, we're going to look around here and get started, so stay, stick with us. Oh, it's still soft, see? Okay, we got some, uh, we're trying to figure, hey Elsa, how you doing girl? We're trying to figure out this, we got some killer pattern going on this. This hexagonal pattern. Look at that. It just this whole thing's that way. Just amazing. Okay, we're gonna step over here and look at some of this, and I could film this all day, all day long. This is incredible. So this is all biological. Um, those pieces just didn't. Anyway, this is so cool. A good find here. But anyway, that's what all this is in here. We believe it's a uh, skin that's collapsed down. Okay, we go here. Look at these discs. He thought they were eyes. We're not sure. 
by the way, you ladies, Scott's single. <laughs> hey, Scott, we're trying to find your wife. Are you? <laughs> Tell him you're single. Boy, this is this is good. Wow, this this you know what? This looks like an almost like an eye. It's like decayed and peeled off, though. I'm not sure. Well, I mean, everything would like flatten and mold together if it's saturated in water and yeah. fossilized. So you get like the rim of the. You see, it's just worn out. Right. All that stuff. Well, this is something he's dipped. So we're not. He's not. We're not sure what they are yet. We're still trying to figure it out. There's another one over there. We'll go look at in a minute. That one looks like an eye. Yeah, I'm gonna get up on top of this one and see all the moss growing inside. I'm in the like all of the cracks where the it's feeding on the the, the moss is feeding on the uh, the blood or whatever inside this thing. I'd imagine. Let me get up on top of here. Well, I don't know if I can get up on top. This thing looks like an eye. You almost have the brow there, and an eyeball. But I'm not sure. I don't know what it is. I guess something could have protruded out of it. All right, I'm gonna go over here and look at this now. You know, and you come along, you, you can see these things how they they run in there. This runs in there. I mean, come on, man, this is biological. Are you kidding me? Wake up, world. Sorry, right, getting excited here today. Look at these going that way. He's over here going that way. Okay, we're gonna step up to these walls and look at these cliff walls. That's all skin up there that's sloughed down. See the red? Transitioning metals in it. Okay, and this is really cool. This is what I'm talking about. I believe this is, this is what I have in common with all my videos here lately. I'll show you. This substance right here uh, you would normally call it bedrock, I guess. This runs out. Look at those things. This runs out underneath all that. And in my last videos and the ones I got coming up, this all runs out. And everything out there is sitting on top of this stuff, whatever this is, hard as a rock. This is this is, must be uh, the main body of the creature. I don't know, but it runs out in underneath all this skin, and everything else sits on top of it. Even in my last videos, you'll find this in it. And uh, all the tendon entices are sitting on top of this. Look at this. We just found this. Okay, well, we're going to head back over the other way. I don't want this video to go too long. Okay, we gotta get this pattern here. This is biology. Look at this. This here is biology. It's the same soft stuff. Yep. It's soft too. It's kale and clay. This is absolute biology. This is so cool. Yeah, we get excited here today. We got a lot. Scott just broke this open. It's more of that clay. Just you can peel it with your finger. Look at this. You can. I can peel this with my finger. Look at that. This whole thing's made of that. This is this is kale and clay, man. This is biological. We're getting really excited here today. This is a good find. Everybody just walks over it and we know what it is. Alright, we're heading over this way. Check this out. Okay. This is all biological. There's that's some more the interstitch in this. I mean not interstitch, but the skin, kale and clays. Look at this. Yeah. Don't look at it like a rock. Look at it it's like it's biologically been preserved. Look at it like it's uh, biology in each piece is individual cell, or not cells, but you know, you'll figure it out. That's how I try to look at things. I don't look at them like rocks anymore. This is all biological that's connected down in here somewhere is the rest of the creature. Comes up out of that, so we need all the red in there. 
all the reds in there. You think they're just rocks? They're not just rocks. But anyway, okay, well, we're going to wrap this up. Look at some more of this clay over here. This kale and clay. We head to the other beach. Okay, this is really cool. We're on our way out. We got the brown kale and clays in here and the gray. You can peel this stuff off with your fingers. And it's just brown. This is brown. So you got the brown clay, kale and clays, and you got the gray. Pattern. Same crazy pattern. Look at this. You peel it off your fingers. And it's just super fine powder. Look at this. It's really fine. And you got the gray right here. Which is the same way. Really fine. So you got two types of kale and clay which is underneath the skin. So this is absolutely 100% certified biological. In my opinion. <laughs> All right. Oh, this is awesome. This is so cool. Look at this pattern. Okay, we're heading over here and check out some stuff over there, so. And then we're gonna head to the other beach, so stick around.